Yo, Bobby, what's going on, brother? Hmm. Yeah, same old, same old here. No, not the same old. Same old, same old. Mount same old. Oh, Bobby, I gotta go. Bye. Kevin Joseph Christo here. Uh, welcome to another episode from uh, El Studio de Christophe. Uh, today, we're going to be continuing uh, to visit uh, some some early writings from uh, moi. Okay, uh, thanks for tuning in, and uh, let's get started. This is just like, I think, some more recent stuff. Today is going to be the greatest day of my life. Art shall be my profession. If it's good for all, it's good for me. When my body comes to die, light will I become. How do people go along with the charade? Work jobs that steal their souls? Let handheld devices run their lives? Taking in excessive amounts of information, forward tilting posture. I remember I wrote this when I was at the airport on my way back from Boston, where I had just completed a residency in, uh, in art or farting. I don't know what, what I was doing there, but I was doing something with paint and yeah. Um, this is a a picture I drew of my good friend Philip. Philip was a theologist. His father used to run the Concord prison. Uh, he used to vacation with the Kennedys, and Philip lived in the woods in Concord, Massachusetts for 40 years. Uh, it is my understanding that today uh, Philip no longer drinks alcohol and is doing very well. And Philip is one of my absolute best, best friends who taught me many uh, survival techniques on the road and in life in general. Um, this is another picture I drew of Philip. He used to sit on this electrical box outside 7-Eleven, uh, and he used to call all the, the, the you know, the youngins in the town his kids. And um, you know, he really was like a father to the misfits, and will always be. So I wrote, uh, "Courage is moving from familiar to unfamiliar." Known to the unknown, this is growing, is to know what life truly is. I believe that's actually a quote from Henry David Thoreau. David Henry Thoreau? Thoreau. I always forget that. Henry David, I believe. Um, just some more imagery. You know, I like to do the uh, symmetry. Oh, this was when I was in the airport on my way back from Boston as well, same day. Uh, today I travel with my arms still itching. It has been four weeks or so of basic t continual tightness and itching of the areas of skin on my forearms and lower legs. I feel like a science experiment most days. What did they put in my body when I was a newborn? Did vaccines cause me to itch like this? Will people ever get tired of keeping up with the Joneses? Put down your phones. We're losing ourselves. Place to shower. $30. $280 for everything. I just spotted another hippie in the airport, stuck out amongst the suit and ties. This is also from the airport that day. My pants look dirty because they are. These are the honest pants of the artist. Scraping for continued survival, most of my resources go towards food and rent. I wear these dirty pants with pride. I'd like to change that word because eh, pride, eh, it is one of the seven, so we'd have to edit that. My face looks worn because it is. Not having showered in more than a week, this life is filled with humility. The dirt humbles me. 
my heart is heavy with the pain of our current humanity. So few have the resources they need for even the most basic aspects of life. I mean, like, this is pretty much what I looked like at the airport. I was kind of like a pig pen. <laughs> oh, man, I feel bad forever sat next to me on that flight. Uh, uh, this is a group poem that was written by, with some friends. With open hearts and minds, with forgiveness and gratitude, and union and communion with Earth Mother, as above, so below. Dream weave the dream of one, be the medicine for all, as above, so below. I am as we are, dancing the stream, singing with the wind. We hear the ancient voices echoing all around. Ancient voices place the seed of our truth. Drums echoing in the night. Sacred fires blazing, dancing, all is one. Now we are claiming our power from the sun. Sovereignty be our soul tribe calling. Shining bright, even in the night. Forever rejoicing on eternal flight. Come fly with us, fly and be free, soaring through valley, mountain, desert, and sea. Inside gravity, the same thing happens, only slow, as above and so below. Well, I think we'll end uh, for today on that note. Um, thank you for your time, and uh, peace to all.